massive nuclear bombs, enormous volcanoes, and devastating asteroid impacts are all examples of powerful Earth detonations. Our planet has been shattered by a number of massive explosions, ranging from early asteroid bombardment to the development of nuclear weapons. But the size of the biggest explosion on Earth varies depending on the scale you're looking at, whether it was caused by humans or by huge space rocks. A Soviet superweapon known as Tsar Bomba tops the list of the largest human-caused explosions ever recorded. Meanwhile, over 70,000 years ago, the climate-altering Toba supervolcano produced the largest terrestrial explosion. Regarding the largest blast from an extraterrestrial source that left clear evidence, the enormous Friedfurt crater was carved 2 billion years ago by an asteroid larger than the one that killed the dinosaurs. Unless, of course, you include the Moon as evidence, Earth's satellite was most likely formed 4.5 billion years ago when a planet-sized impactor collided with Earth, releasing enough energy to dwarf anything Earth has seen since. According to Sam Rigby, an associate professor at the Blast and Impact Engineering Research Group at the University of Sheffield in the United Kingdom, the 1985 intentional blast known as Minor Threat contained the most power of any non-nuclear explosion in history. A 4.7 kiloton TNT explosion was created using 4,700 tons of ammonium nitrate and fuel oil in a U.S. military operation designed to observe the results of nuclear-scale blasts. That is nearly one-third the force of Little Boy, a 15-kiloton atom bomb that destroyed Hiroshima during World War II. Even though the minor scale is close to the size of early atomic bombs, more advanced nuclear weapons made that enormous blast appear to be quite small. A massive thermonuclear bomb was dropped by the Soviet Union over the deserted Novaya Zimoli Islands in the north of Russia in 1961. According to adjunct professor George William Herbert at the James Martin Center for Non-Proliferation Studies in California, it was dubbed Tsar Bomba and exploded with the force of 50 to 60 megatons of TNT, making it the largest nuclear explosion ever carried out. The fireball was wider than the area of the damage that was done in Hiroshima, it detonated with more than 3,300 times the power of Little Boy. Nearly six and a half kilometers, four miles, from ground zero of destruction would have been caused by the bomb's energy yield, this estimate is nearly doubled when explosion duration is taken into account. The bomb's original design would have produced 100 megatons of DNT, but military planners decreased the yield of the explosive so that the bomber could safely fly away. For eons, the Earth has been the source of megaton-plus explosions. According to NASA's Earth Observatory, Mount Dambora blew off its 13,000-foot, 4,000-meter, peak in 1815, causing the largest volcanic eruption in recorded history in Indonesia. According to Oregon State University volcanologist Shanaka da Silva, Dambora detonated with the equivalent of 800 megatons of TNT, which is more than 14 times the yield of Tsar Bomba. According to the Geological Society of London, the epic blast sound traveled 1,615 miles 2,600 kilometers, to Sumatra. NASA says that in 1816, Dambora material spewed into the atmosphere blocking enough sunlight to cause global cooling in the year without a summer. According to the University Corporation for Atmospheric Research, snow fell in New England and gloomy, cold rains fell throughout Europe that summer responsible for several years of colder winters and colder summers in Europe and famine around the world was probably the eruption. The Volcanic Explosivity Index VEI, a logarithmic scale similar to the Richter scale, gave the Tambora blast a score of 7, meaning that each unit increase represented 10 times the explosive power. According to a study published in Science in 2022, the Hunga-Tonga hunga Hapai eruption in January 2022 produced the strongest pressure wave ever measured in Earth's atmosphere. However, that eruption ranks only 5 or 6 in comparison. However, eruptions another order of magnitude greater than Tambora are documented in prehistory. These so-called super-eruptions detonated with the force of 10,000 megatons of TNT when they reached V8. 
that amounts to more than 660,000 Hiroshima bombs and 200 Tsar bombas. In addition, there is evidence of at least three V9 eruptions, the largest of which was the youngest Obatov eruption, which occurred 74,000 years ago in Indonesia. The TNT equivalent produced by Toba ranged from hundreds of thousands to billions of megatons. The Toba eruption probably brought about a significant cooling of the planet, which affected the growing seasons. According to a 2022 study co-authored by De Silva and published in the journal Frontiers in Earth Science, Toba's seismic effects may have triggered another V9 supervolcano eruption on the opposite side of the globe, in the region that is now Guatemala. De Silva drew attention to the fact that these massive volcanoes only represent those that produced conclusive evidence. Especially in Earth's early history, other eruptions of a similar or even larger magnitude are likely to have occurred. Well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comment section. And if you enjoy our content, and never want to miss a video, hit the subscribe button. Thank you for watching.